So, for example, if a uh, child were to come to me with a uh, learning difficulty, no matter how hard they try to, you know, improve their studies or sit down and focus, they just can't get there. They just can't make it happen. And so what I look at is, you know, is there uh, an emotional issue just with the teacher? Is there a blockage uh, in their brain between taking in information through the, the visual or auditory centers and transferring that information to, to short-term memory or long-term memory. You know, there could be so many different factors. It could be the fluorescent lights of the room that's actually affecting this child's brain. It could be a yeast overgrowth in the gut that is affecting their uh, ability to process information. So we're addressing so many different levels and layers of function in the brain um, that it's, you know, each each person that comes to me is a whole different uh, story. So you have to really have them on the table and working with them to really start to understand. And they start to understand how their brain works as well. They start to say, oh, I get why I was having so much trouble. And it's kind of an amazing process because they kind of learn to forgive themselves for whatever deficits that they were having in school or in life. They say, oh, no wonder I was having so much difficulty. I can suddenly understand, you know, where I where I've been coming from and why I've been having having trouble.